Good afternoon folks, Big Bo here with another great fifth wheel value from Parkway RV Center. Today we're looking at a 2012 Sydney fifth wheel by Outback Keystone. Folks, this is the 10th anniversary edition. It's uh, got a really unique floor plan I think you're going to love. It's a 328 FKS, 328, 36 feet long overall. It has three power slide outs. Only weighs 9,660 pounds, and the reason why it weighs so much less than most traditional triple slide fifth wheels, if you'll notice how much higher up the other fifth wheels sit, this is a mid-profile, very aerodynamic fifth wheel. You still got a stand-up bedroom in the front, but you've got a lower overall roof line, and that, of course, equals uh, less weight and easier to tow and better fuel mileage. Uh, this camper is Four Seasons model. It's got alloy wheels. It's an absolute bargain for what it is, folks. It's got a 36.5 NADA and a, like a 34 NADA base retail with no options, and I'm only asking 27.9 for it. This is a Chattanooga area trade-in. It was traded in at a new vehicle dealer. And of course, since we've been in business so long, all the all the car dealers around here call us every time somebody wants to trade one of these in. And of course, we buy it from them. But I'm going to tell you, this thing is absolutely beautiful condition. The decals, the striping, you can tell it's not been parked out in the weather and all faded and got the aerodynamic front end. This is going to be an easy tow. Got the LED lights to help you hook up. You know, three power slide outs, got 50 amp service, got actually got the optional second air conditioner. And I'm going to tell you folks, you're going to love the interior. I'll go over that here in a minute. No delamination. The corners aren't beat up. You know, you always want to look in the rear corners of any fifth wheel because people are notorious for backing up into stuff. And you can see it uh, looks great. Not beat up anywhere on either side. Tires look great. I'm going to tell you folks, this is an absolute bargain. It's, it's almost $10,000 under NADA. And it's a CPO, a certified pre-owned, so it's going to include a 138-point inspection by our certified RV techs. And it's going to include a 90-day nationwide limited warranty that can be extended very, very affordably, folks. And I'm telling you, you're really missing out if you don't at least get a quote on a warranty because, I mean, how, where, I mean peace of mind, you're buying it so far under book anyway, you might as well splurge a little bit and get a warranty and and have peace of mind to boot so if you're going to finance one that's a great way to do it because you can add it to your payment for a few more dollars a month you've got protection but folks whether you take the extended warranty or not we you do get the 90 day this nationwide limited warranty and that 138 point inspection at no additional cost to you folks ain't that just a great deal it's it's so far under book plus you get that warranty and that uh checkout you know i think you're starting to see why part of the reason why we've been in business for almost 50 years got outside speakers outside scare lights um, all aluminum welded structure of course this is the 10th anniversary edition the 328 frk and folks i'm gonna tell you something for those of you who watch my videos subscribe to my youtube channel you know i've, I've got a motorhome and a class a motorhome and, and one thing me and my wife love to do is cook and even though we've got a decent sized kitchen in ours I'm gonna tell you when I saw this floor plan, I had to put it. I mean, I had to put it right on because I love this floor plan. And if you like to cook a lot like we do, you're going to fall in love with this setup. Let's step on inside first of all. Inside is there's no other way to really describe it except like new, or like new for a 2012 model. It is four years old, but I'm gonna tell you it's a. Uh, we'll shut this door, save that air conditioning because it is miserably hot but look at this rear kitchen folks and you don't usually see a rear kitchen triple slide in this size but i love this because you've got you know we do a lot of cooking you've got a bar right here great place for a breakfast bar you've got all this food prep area you got real corian countertops i believe that's an upgrade for the outbacks you even got corian sinks uh the mowing faucets you got the atwood appliances um man this thing's nice uh this kitchen to me would be you know and i i said this on one of the fifth wheel folks and i dang near did it and this makes me want to go from a class a to a truck and a fifth wheel just after seeing all this 
beautiful interior folks look at the lighting in here all the nice light fixtures it's got a, a big HD TV I've got a DVD playing right now it's got inside and outside speakers uh, big Dometic two-way RV refrigerator freezer solid hardwood cabinets day night shades uh, you've got a pull-out sleeper sofa with a built-in air mattress fireplace which can you can set for the effect which I don't need the heat right now but you also can use it in the winter time as an auxiliary electric heater Plus, you've got DSI heat. Everything in here is original, folks. The carpet, the upholstery, it all looks like it's hardly ever been used at all. I mean, this is a nice, nice fifth wheel. All the remotes are there. You, even the fireplace has remote control. Got the nice hardwood cabinets. Um, I like the French door leading into the front bedroom and bathroom. But just step back and look at this kitchen, folks. I don't know about you, but this is, and it's still got a tall enough roof for everybody, but boy, that air's getting cold too. I'm going to tell you, it's, uh, it's miserably hot today. But we even as hot as it is, I mean, I'll show you, folks, we're still blowing. Oh, if I can catch this right here. As you can see, we're blowing out 40s out of the air vents. I actually had it breeding 39 a minute ago, but it's dropping. Just that 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 compressor cycles. When it cycles, it gets a little bit lower. But you can see we're in the low 40s, which, considering it's 100 degrees in the shade right now, that's hard to beat. And that's not even counting the front air. And I'll show you the freezer and everything too. I don't mind doing that. I actually had a rare opportunity to let this thing run long enough for everything to get cold. I usually don't have enough time to do that, especially in the refrigerators. But you can see we're blowing cold in there. And blowing cold there. 50 degrees in the fridge and below freezing in the freezer. That's what you want to see. Check out the NADA out so you know I'm not just blowing you full of smoke. As you can see, 12 Sydney, 10th anniversary fifth wheel, 328FRK, just like I showed you outside. Even if you don't add anything, it's 34.7. And now, folks, let me tell you something about these NADAs. I've seen so many people do it. I've seen two or three people do it today. They get on these NADAs, they add options like crazy, really overvaluing their product. You know, in 2012, you can't buy this unit without three slide outs because that's what came on as standard. You couldn't buy this unit without a refrigerator. You couldn't buy it without a microwave, a stovetop, an oven, an air conditioner. You couldn't buy it without a furnace, water heater uh, in 2012. I don't care how much money you had. You know, the only thing I added for was the fireplace and this unit came standard with a manual awning and I added for the electric awning and the aluminum wheels, folks. That's all that and really that far under book it really doesn't matter it's obviously so far under book it's crazy and keep in mind that this is book value on a used camper without a warranty or a checkout we're selling it for 27.9 with a warranty with a checkout almost ten thousand dollars or eighty five hundred under nada i mean this is a nice fifth wheel look at the crown molding you know, Outback is one of the most popular fifth wheel brands of all time, and, and I can see why. Beautiful interior. We got a French door leading into the front bedroom. And up here, and here's what I was talking about, folks. It's still got a stand up bedroom, but you just don't have as tall height clearance toward the closet as most other brands. But you're not really giving up any comfort, and you're gaining a lot of fuel mileage and a lot of wear and tear in your truck too. Uh, got a Queen Island bed, you got a big closet across the front, plenty of storage. You've got the second air conditioner which does blow ice cold. I cut it off because well, I didn't really need it up here and plus I was afraid I was going to overload the breaker on our plug-in running two airs at once because I've got it hooked into 30. But uh, you got the chest of drawers at the bottom of the bed. A really nice bathroom step in here you got the glass surround shower skylights you can see there's no there's no damage no water damage all the roof's been serviced like it's supposed to uh lavatory area you got the upgrade to medic rv toilet the china rv toilet everything's enclosed here on the side so if somebody's getting ready in the restroom you you've got you're not blocking access to the bedroom or 
you can close this French door and you've got the entire bedroom and bathroom to get ready in. So you got a huge, comfortable uh, bedroom and bathroom area up here. You've got that second air conditioner, so you don't have to worry about getting too hot. Of course, over here is all your control panels, uh, water pump, the power awning switch, uh, electric and gas water heater, all your lights, and of course your slide out controls right there. And folks, remember, we go through a 138-point inspection before we uh, deliver this RV to you or before you pick it up. But I'm going to tell you right now, I plugged it in and everything works. I mean, this thing is in beautiful condition. Everything. Uh, see, the, the, even the speakers work. I had all the speakers on earlier when I was checking it out myself. And folks, I'm going to tell you, this is a nice, a nice fifth wheel. And one of the few that makes me want to reconsider owning a motorhome, I'll be honest with you. This one's 27.9, will trade. You can see by the book value, it's extremely under book. And it's got a warranty. So that warranty's worth a couple thousand dollars by itself. And it's a coach net warranty. So the biggest warranty rider in the, in the country. And that's who Forest River uses and several other brands. So folks, give us a call, 706-965-7929. This one's going to sell quick. Evenings and Sundays, you can get sales help at 423-605-6747. Visit our website, parkwayrvcenter.com or .net. I've got a great selection of fifth wheels right now, folks, and they're going quick. And we're trying to buy every one we can get our hands on, but bargains like this don't hit the market every day. And especially this rear kitchen. I'm going to tell you, somebody's going to fall in love with that floor plan uh, because you just hardly ever see a triple slide rear kitchen fifth wheel. There's nothing wrong with a rear lounge, but that's 99.9% .9 of the fifth wheels on the market with three or more slides are rear lounges. So to see a one like this is uh, really a treat for me because I'm, a, I guess, a self-proclaimed amateur chef. <laughs> but me and my wife, we cook a lot when we go camping. I mean a ton. So that's something we enjoy doing. Don't even cook that much at home, but we do a lot when we're on the road in our motorhome. And I really can appreciate that kitchen back there and I'm sure a lot of you can too so give us a call drop us an email uh, we don't have commission sales people folks we have no add-on sales fees you know other RV dealers average 10% in add-on sales fees and all those fees are hundred percent dealer profit and completely unnecessary to purchase a used or even a brand new RV. So for all these years, for those of you who've bought RVs before from dealers and you pay dock fees and you pay this ridiculous freight fee charge that they're now starting to charge everybody, uh, if you paid um, processing fee, dock fee, prep, whatever they want to call it, we call them rip-off fees, folks. They're all 100% dealer profit. And if you are buying an RV from somewhere and they're charging you anything other than sales tax and the sales price you need to get up and walk out unless of course like you're buying a warranty or you're paying to have it delivered there's no reason to charge any extra fees and they're all 100 percent dealer profit and these dealers and and i hear it every day folks i have customers come in here every day this so-and-so dealer was going to charge uh, gave me a price and then when they gave me the out the door price it was six seven thousand dollars higher and that's because of all the fees and the bs that they add to the deal that's why you always insist on getting the out-the-door price because a sales price, they can make up a low sales price by charging you thousands of dollars in fees, folks. It's a common practice. Uh, I know I'm not going to mention any dealership names, but a dealership up the street from us, largest in the country, they sponsor NASCAR. You probably know who I'm talking about. Uh, they sell brand new Coleman campers, $99.95, little old 14, 15 foot campers. But I have customers come in here all the time. Well, by the time I got out of there, it was going to be almost $17,000. That $99.95 camper turned into almost $17,000. And that's because they started adding all those fees to make up for the low sales price. And all those fees are 100% profit. So don't fall victim to that game, folks. It's uh, A lot of people are, and I'm hoping I can save somebody from losing that kind of money by listening to my ads. You know, at Parkway RV Center, we've been in business 48 years. We sell over 500 used RVs a year. And we sell, we're a certified power, power seller on eBay with hundreds of positive feedbacks. And folks, people on eBay are bargain shoppers. You don't sell that many on eBay unless you've got the lowest prices out there. And that's what we do, folks. 
Uh, you can compare our prices to anybody. We give you a free warranty on qualifying units like this 2012 Outback Sydney. Uh, you know, we've been in business a long time. We don't charge you any fees. We have great finance rates. If you need to finance this RV, folks, I can get you interest rates as low as 3%. Folks, you couldn't even buy this camper brand new and spend over 50 grand and get a 3% interest rate. And the reason why is because other RV dealers exploit people who need to finance campers and motorhomes and fifth wheels. By marking the interest rate up, sometimes double over what the bank approves you for, and the bank lets them keep the profit they make from doubling the interest rate, and sometimes they even triple it, folks. Uh, that's why so many people that, that come into dealerships are upside down in their trade-ins because they went to these corporate dealers, they let them jack them up on the price, they let them jack them up on the fees and the interest rate, and that's why they owe so much more than their RV's worth. I see it every day, folks. Uh, I've had people come in here and I had the exact same unit that they're trading in, and my price on the lot was eight to ten thousand dollars less than what they still owed on theirs. And when they saw that, they said they didn't even bother trying to trade because they, they didn't know how bad they were sunk in theirs until they saw the same unit that they owned for eight to ten thousand dollars less on my lot. And that happens a lot, folks. It's just you know it's crazy, and, and uh, I try to help everybody I can. You know, I can get some negative equity covered on this one because it's so far under book, but, you know, I don't want to bury you in this thing either. So, you know, I, you know, we kind of walk a very fine line when it comes to that, people who are upside down on their trade-ins because we don't want to make a, a bad situation worse. So give us a call. Drop us an email. Uh, you can email us at sales at parkwayrvcenter.com. Uh, we don't have commission salespeople. That saves you a ton of money because you go to these other RV dealerships that use commission salespeople, which is a, most of them, and it costs you thousands of dollars. It's a practice that's a century out of date. What it is, a commission salesperson doesn't get paid by the hour. They don't get paid salary. The average RV commission rate is 25% of the gross profit. So that means when you deal with these commission salespeople, every dollar they knock off the price or every dollar they put more into your trade-in is 25 cents less in their pocket. That also means that when it comes to the price, that that RV dealer has to mark their units up an additional 25% to cover the salesperson's commission. That's why these commission salespeople play all these gimmicks and games that everybody hates when it comes to buying anything used or even brand new is all the games the gimmicks they they try to pull on you all the uh, all the tricks and they do that because they only get paid when they produce a sale well my guys are completely opposite folks my salespeople are salary only they get paid the same whether you buy this camper or this fifth wheel from us or don't buy it or buy from somewhere else as far as their paychecks concerned they, it doesn't bother them because it doesn't affect their paycheck one bit this way they can concentrate on your wants and needs instead of their own uh, because the commission salesperson is always going to put themselves first so they can make the most money out of selling you an RV or a camper where our guys well they get paid the same so they're just here to help you out and answer questions when you have the lowest prices on the internet like we do you don't have to pay people to sell when you look up this thing online when you look at the NADA you look at what other dealers are asking for the same make and model without a warranty and their prices are thousands higher than ours plus those fees and all that other stuff I told you about always get the out the door price I don't care what their sales price is always insisting on getting the out the door price and you're going to be shocked how much more the out the door price is than the sales price so just just don't commit to anything till you get the uh, the out the door price but folks you're going to be very impressed with my inventory we've got the best prices out there on the internet that's why we sell 500 plus rvs campers and fifth wheels a year all over the country we've sold in all 50 states including multiple sales to alaska and hawaii uh we've sold over uh, actually a couple thousand RVs all over Canada our prices are so low that people come two or three thousand miles away and we do offer nationwide delivery you just pay whatever it costs us to uh, to bring the RV to you and get my driver back home not a dime more well I like the view from this bar I don't know about you but this is really neat especially if you're entertaining but but folks we you just pay whatever it costs us to deliver it to you we don't make any profit on delivery we just ask that you cover expenses that's it and other dealers i know they they try to double what they have in delivery but we don't 
and our guys, you know, unlike these guys on U-Ship and all these other places, and there's some good guys on there too. I've used them before, and, there, and there's good ones and bad ones on there, but my guys have got dec years and years, I was going to say decades, but I, they haven't worked here that long, but they, I do have drivers with years of experience hauling RVs all over the country, and all types of weather, all times of the year, so they're going to take care of it because they've got the experience. You get a lot of these yahoos on these uh, shipping sites and they've never towed anything this big before. You don't know how, what kind of shape it's going to be in when it gets there after they're done with it. So I, I tend to trust my guys a little better because I know how they take care of stuff. But if you want delivery, just get it. When you get a hold of your non-commissioned salesperson, they'll be happy to give you a price on delivery or you can come pick it up folks if you pick it up here in person my rv techs will go over this thing with you front to back top to bottom after it's been checked out of course we'll show you how to operate everything give you a personal demonstration and give you a starter kit with all your all your hoses and everything you need to take it to the campground and it's as easy as that folks you do a little paperwork you hook it up to your truck and you go it's, there's no nothing complicated you don't have to go from person to person to person to like these big rv dealerships you deal with rv tech and you deal with your rv salesperson that's it folks handshake to handshake so give us a call drop us an email i post rvs every single day so subscribe to my youtube channel the link is on the home page of my website or if you want to look me up on youtube it's all one word parkway rv center thank you for watching i hope to see you soon here in beautiful Ringgold, Georgia.